Get on the ladder. Tempted to just indiscriminately use these flares all over the place. Although it isn't going to help with my stealth. <laughs> Not that it matters too much if they're too stupid to realize where it came from. Anything over here? No, that's just a dead end. Alright. Right, they're all preoccupied with that shit down there. <clears throat> so I should be able to move through here pretty nicely. Without any major worries. At least for a little bit. <clears throat> Till I run into this guy. Okay, I'm dead again. God damn it. Sloppy, but it worked. And honestly, I'll take sloppy over not working any day. It's a shame you can't destroy the cameras in this one. That'd be pretty handy. I come to think of it, I should probably take care Terry yeah, take care of the guys back here. It'd be a lot easier if I still had this. Just sneak back down here and uh, see what I can do. I need uh oh. <laughs> Whoops. Well, so much for non-lethal on that one. So that's just the guy in the bridge. Shit, come to think of it, that, that was probably the... No, it can't have been the guy with the flamethrower. This is the guy. Stop seeing me. Okay, so how much space do I need for the flamethrower? Probably a lot. Will that be enough? Hell yeah. I just need to go back and get that other dude's ammo at some point before leaving here. R will describe your next assignment and stay behind to protect the Ambrosia. Look for her out front. <clears throat> okay, that's good. So I think the main objective here is taken care of. 
Only took a few tries, some of which will not be televised. But I got it to work. <clears throat> Damn it, I used up all my lambs, so I guess I have to pick this lock. I'm really hoping it's worth it. It almost is. Main problem, of course, being that, uh... <clears throat> I don't really know if I have any way to open this right now. Never mind, this actually works. Wow. I was not expecting that. I may as well get rid of the crowbar. Let's be honest here, it's... Probably not gonna be that useful. Still just kinda holding on to the, uh... Silence pistol here, just in case I decide I want to use it at some point. You know, it's completely... wimpy and worthless compared to the standard. Let's just see if I can, uh... Turn off the cameras for all of these. Yes, now hopefully that is all the cameras in this uh, facility. I think I may have alerted somebody. Killing me. What the fuck? I just took 30 damage to the head. Alright, you bummy bastard. Where did you run to? Beat down, asshole. Take a nap on those pipes. <clears throat> so, what now? What now? Should be a couple of uh, NSF losers up here. And some kid just sitting you here. You a cop? You not co agent. How does a little boy get mixed up with the NSF? I just wanted to find some food, but they didn't have any. And then they started shooting at the police. Got some? Sorry, I don't have any food. Aw, oh, man. Guess now I gotta look for some. This is dangerous. There's a lot of people here. And now I'm worried that he's gonna end up seeing me. <clears throat> Quiet. I think we got cop. That flare is a cop. I still have nothing here? Damn it. Yes, go that way. Wait, quiet. Wait, quiet. Nothing. I guess we're safe. I'm still seriously considering trying to do some non lethal around here. I guess we're safe. Thank you for opening that locked door for me. Ha. 
and a door key. Completely pointless machine, no reason to use it. Thankfully they're all deaf and don't hear me breaking boxes, otherwise I could be in trouble here. <clears throat> hey, thanks for the support, guys. Now you could probably do something about this. Just not sure what to do here. Let's pick this for one thing. See if there's anything useful inside. Uh, not immediately useful, but useful. Nonetheless. Okay, let's be insane for a second. <laughs> this is not going to work out. Just as I thought, okay. I'll just be stealing this box now. Don't mind me. You got nothing. All clear. Yeah, all clear. I got this one. Like I said, all clear. This isn't even a real door, what the hell? Hey kid, stop I just running around. To find some food. You can have this soy food. You're cool. Glad I could help. Hey, I bet I can help you. Yeah? The soldiers have secret tunnels. They take boxes into the tunnel under the fort, but they never bring them back out. What kind of boxes? Steel. Big ones. Thanks. Maybe I'll check that out. I don't think the reward is particularly pointful. You know, things considered, he... I think he more or less just kind of pointed me to something I already figured or, uh, explored and figured out and all that. <clears throat> well, either way, that's one less goon to worry about there over here. Bunch of ammunition. And never mind, my not very stealthy uh, stealth attempts have unsurprisingly failed. No time to slaughter a couple guys. Wait. Hello. Get the fuck out of my inventory. I do not want you. Locked. Fucking hell. Wow, really? That's a bit annoying. Oh, never mind, I can just... Partially destroy it? What the hell? Maybe I can beat it down some more with a knife? Hell yeah. 
Hmm. Let's just test to see how this works. I'm actually not sure how that works then. Because <clears throat> both doors are of the same basic material, and yet only one of them seems to be possible to uh, destroy. Actually, let's push this thing out of the way. Maybe there's something behind it? Or I can just, you know, kind of block my exit door. Nah, there's nothing. Check if there's anything in the water. Probably nothing, but it's worth a check. Oh yeah, this is that one dude I kind of threw in the water. I wonder if he's still classified as unconscious. By the way, what's my health looking like? Pretty bad. Just heal that up. He's unconscious, seriously. Nice jump, JC. And if you could actually get out of the water when doing that, it would be much appreciated. Okay, I'm just gonna go out on a limb and guess that the railing with no supports is what's stopping me from being able to do that. Also, I remember being able to see through the water. Like it being transparent. I'm gonna have to look at that at some point here. Because I should be running on 62 or 32 bits uh, color here, and I don't know why it, it's looking like it's running on 16 bit. Anyway, I'm running back to grab that uh, crowbar. Assuming I left it in an accessible area. Don't tell me I threw it into the water. Damn it, I want that crowbar. So I'm actually seeing now that it's got some uses. <sighs> really? I can't believe that that crowbar seems to have Okay, let's check again. Did I throw it into the water? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna search for this off camera. Be back in a bit. Okay, so, um... We're out here, <clears throat> currently right at the entrance of the level. And, um... Well, I turned on the camera because I found this. Medical crates, or medical crate and uh, general supply crates right here in the water. I don't imagine you can go out very far in the water, but uh, that in and of itself is pretty cool. I don't think I found that in my first playthrough. <clears throat> I just need to get onto this ladder and up. I was, I was going to just... There we go. I was just gonna say, uh, tell, not, or not show for this, but... Um, since I'm in the area, I may as well just point out... There was a ten mil box of 10 mil millimeter ammo in the bottom of the water there. So yeah, still looking around for the crowbar and other stuff. Uh, be back in a bit. Never mind, Agent Navarre is going to chase me. You are not afraid to kill. I am pleased. The last thing I would expect from the brother of Paul. I'm learning as I go. And you are learning fast, too. Lesson two was supposed to be the subway station, but you took care of it already. They had hostages down there. Good work. Next, you must take the subway to Hell's Kitchen, where your brother Paul is in heavy fighting. You can have the EMP grenades I was going to give you for the booby traps on the subway station platform. It's been a pleasure, Agent. I hope we can work together again.
excellent work. I hear that every terrorist in the subway is flat on his back. You are showing some promise. Take the subway and report to your brother in Hell's Kitchen. Your brother Paul has gotten our troops into another mess. Paul has his unit scattered and pinned down by heavy resistance in Hell's Kitchen. The NSF regrouped in Hell's Kitchen, perhaps because it is close to where they have taken the Ambrosia. You have your orders. I will manage the situation in Battery Park. You have your order. Okay then. Well. It's not like I had much of a choice in the subway station. I mean, I... <clears throat> kind of ran out of uh, non-lethal options there. And now I don't have space for the uh, thing anyway. The crowbar anyway. Shit. Well, whatever. One of these guys had a flamethrower, so I can uh, grab the ammo for that from them. Presumably. If I can remember where exactly that particular body was. Maybe he was at the subway? I remember there being some more NSF bodies up here as well. I'm not sure why, uh... Well, it definitely wasn't one of these guys. Nor them. So Anna was going to give me EMP grenades to deal with this. So let's just see if this does anything about the, uh, wires. does that. Which is not as useful as I would like, but you saved my life. it's useful. I'll be okay. Thanks. Oh well, I don't really need the extra ammo that much. They're shooting. Why do they keep shooting? Sometimes I hear things in my head. It's not normal. Majestic. 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 You're closer to being on track than you think, buddy. Yeah? How's it look on the street? How's what look? The fighting. Is it heavy? The cops told me to take cover in the bar or come down here. They've got the NSF surrounded in the Ton Hotel. Hostages? I don't know. Is that it? Yeah, thanks. That's all I know. I'm just gonna wait it out. Maybe that guy on the steps knows what's going on. Maybe that guy on the steps knows what's going on. City's lit up, man. Yeah. They're setting fires on Wall Street. I heard it on the radio. If this dies down, I'm gonna take myself a nice spread on Park Avenue. I've been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this. I haven't really got sp space for much of anything right now, actually. Kinda sucks. Oh well, let's just grab myself a bit of, uh, money out of this. <clears throat> Obviously not as much as I would get if I had the account number, but, uh, I don't really know where to get that.
So basically, anybody that does anything can be considered a terrorist and should be looked out for. What's the situation here? You're taking over. I've got to get my team ready to raid the warehouse. What about the EMP field? Still in place. Your primary objective will be to locate and disable its power source. Probably an industrial-sized generator in a large building. I'll question some of the locals. I ordered the civilians to take cover a block south of here in the free clinic and at the Underworld Tavern, down on the corner. Maybe I'll start with the tavern. Why'd you have to clear the street? There's still a heavy NSF presence in the streets and we're taking some fire. We could use your help if you get the chance. Maybe I'll do that. If you need any extra equipment, here's the key to my place at the Tun Hotel. Check the secret closet. Remember? The keypad's behind the painting. Just like the movies. Second floor, right? Yeah, and take a charger for the riot prod. We don't need another Anna Navarra shooting spree. Whatever you say. And JC, we'll be waiting for you to take down that EMP field. Use reasonable force like you did on Liberty Island. I've got to assemble my team. You better get moving. I'm counting on you to find that generator. I'm counting on you to... Alright, good. So I've actually got a decent amount of ammo for this now. <clears throat> I just need more... Uh, ...trank darts. Do I have any regular darts? I do. Worst comes to worst, I guess I can use that. We're in report situation in the Ton Hotel, which is at the southeast corner of the block. With Paul, did you meet Mr. Renton and his daughter Sandra? We think at least one of them is still inside. No space for a candy bar. God damn it. That sucks. God, this place is massive. <laughs> Just as I remember it being. That sucks though, not getting an image for this. Man. They're gonna kill him. Nothing. I checked his pockets. You don't live underground and not have one of Charlie's cards. Make him take yeah. off his shoes. Cops just walk right sleep down him. there. They don't give you money unless you're on the council. Take off your shoes. Charlie has no reason to be stingy if he has a currency encoder. They just hacked a few accounts. They have some extra cash, that's it. I'm not asking again. It's just a bunch of us. You go down there to get out of the cold. All right, we'll do it the hard way. That's it. Paul Denton would be proud. Did you see that? Yes, I... It was uncalled for. You mug people great, you need the dough. But you show some respect. What were they after? Especially when it's your ally. They came to us. They wanted an underground base. So those guys were NSF? Yeah, the NSF gives guns to anybody who wants to fight. A lot of people just take the guns and do what they want. So the terrorists are based in the subways? The sewers? They need to move some kind of secret equipment. Our tunnels are like the crossroads. Tell me how to find this base, and I bet I can get the NSF off your back. Underworld. Just remember that word when you see Curly. He lets people in. Me, personally, I don't rob. I think it's wrong. I think Curly went underground, but remember that password. You might need it someday. Appreciate the help. The NSF are all right. It's just some of the people that hang around them, you know? The NSF are all right. It's just some of the people that hang around them, you know? 